In Acts chapter 2, when the Holy Spirit came upon the Christians, there was this explosion of power and growth that happened. And soon thereafter, it, it talks about how 3,000 people were baptized in one day. And so the church has continued to expand for 2,000 years, making more and stronger disciples who make more and stronger disciples. In fact, Faith Bridge is a practical outworking of that. Of course, the last couple of years, we've talked a lot about the multi-campus approach, where we take some of the people and a leader and a staff from, you know, the Klein campus, and we've started our Woodlands campus. And I'm sure there'll be some other Faithbridge campuses that'll come along in the years ahead. The other way that you continue to expand is through church planting. Which one's right, which one's wrong? They're both right, they're both great, they're both fulfilling the Great Commission. What I'm really excited about is that behind the scenes, Faith Bridge has been planting churches, but it's time for everybody to know what we've been doing. That's what makes me really excited about the HCPN group, the Houston Church Planting Network that we began partnering with two years ago. My name is Chad Clarkson. I serve as the executive director of the Houston Church Planting Network, known as HCPN. We want to connect everybody involved in church planning throughout the city. So we're big in collaboration. So our heart is to be really a network of networks or mul multiple groups, denominations, churches uh, coming together to see Houston reached. I get asked pretty frequently why plant another church in Houston? And it is historically, theologically, and statistically a fact that new churches are the single best way to reach lost people. Uh, really, as I look at the Great Commission, go and make disciples. You know, it doesn't say go and plant churches, but I think as you make disciples, uh, out of that, new churches are gonna get started. Faithbridge is considered one of our anchor churches for HCPN. We have a handful of them that are really spread throughout the city. And it's really because of these anchor churches uh, that make HCPN uh, really successful and especially our residency program. So uh, without Faithbridge as one of the partners, uh, HCPN I, th I think wouldn't be where it's at. That means we get to come around these guys and do coaching for them, mentoring, help them think, help them learn, help them see problems that they're gonna have along the way before they ever get there. Each of the pastors in the cohort actually gets sort of extra from the anchor church where they're anchored. And uh, Josh Gosney was anchored at Faith Bridge, has been, is right now anchored at Faith Bridge. So he's been around even more than the rest of the gang. My name is Josh Gosney. I'm the pastor of Wake Church. Um, and we have been working on planting our church now for just a little over a year and a half. So Wake Church, uh, our mission is to wake people up to new life in Christ. We're drawing a circle around this area and saying, this is our area to take. Uh, there's people who need uh, Jesus in that area and it's a mixture from every ethnicity in the in the Oak Ridge area and uh, we feel like we're in the right position to make a difference. Faith Ridge has been absolutely huge in the foundation pieces of Wake uh, and so every week I get to sit underneath the leadership of Faith Bridge, learn, grow from the kids ministry all the way up to worship to um, Pastor Ken and his teaching, serving on the Woodlands campus uh, and getting my hands dirty before I'm planting a church has been huge as well. Uh, Faith Bridge has uh, answered so many huge prayers for us as a church planner that um, otherwise if, if Faith Bridge didn't step in, we, we truly believe that uh, we wouldn't be where we are today. It's just been a joy to watch him learn, to see his eyes sparkle with excitement, to hear his dreams, to help him refine those and, and push towards his launch and the new things that God's gonna be doing at Wake Church. And I'm encouraged, excited, prayerful, hopeful as I look towards uh, the partnership that Faith Bridge will continue to enjoy with Wake Church in the years ahead.